Hi, everybody. At the end of our Iceland cruise aboard the Norwegian Star during the summer of 2022, we took an amazing two day Iceland tour that visited the Golden Circle, South Coast, and the Black Beach. In this video, we'll show you the highlights from this trip for day one, which included visiting the attractions of Iceland's Golden Circle, plus an overnight stay at a geothermal hotel, breakfast included. You also see some of the local Icelandic food we enjoyed during the tour as well. We booked the trip with Viator, and the direct link to the tour is in the description below. There is a three-day version of the tour that visits the Blue Ice Cave, or a one-day option that includes the Blue Lagoon as well. For us, we did the Blue Lagoon on our own during the morning for our flight home from the Kevlavik Airport. The travel company provided pickup directly from the Reykjavik cruise terminal, and we were happy to see that it wasn't a huge tour bus. The pickup point is located at the parking lot in front of the icewear shop at the cruise port, and the pickup time was around 9 a.m. Let's get on the bus and start the tour. Enjoy! If you take a look down the canyon over here, you can see there are boxes at the other end of it. Two huge continental places split apart right there. Wait, is that just me? Yeah. Look at the striation of the rocks, very interesting. Eleven twenty-four a.m. With the cards in the front and the end, and you can play around with the slow motion effect. Make it the geyser. Uh, there's another restaurant. There's another restaurant over here, more like a fast food version of it. Actually, they run nice one. Actually, they have burgers, fish and chips, things like that. I'm gonna probably have to go to a different parking lot here somewhere. A place where there's a whole bunch of people lining up in a, in a, in, in around the mud in the ground. In a way, everybody's holding up their phones like idiots. Well, guess what? Huh. You're supposed to do the same thing. <laughs> if you miss the geyser blowing, then you must be turning your back into it. It actually goes quite high up in the air.
Oh well. at this location then you are basically at the waterfalls and and then if you want to go for a little bit uh, closer uh, photo opportunities then there is pathways leading down from the lower bus parking lot level all the way down to the waterfall itself but if you're going on that hike keep in mind that the closer you come to the waterfall the wetter you're gonna get
Iceland. Because now we're going to say hello to some Icelandic horses. And the horses that we have here in Iceland, this is basically the same horse breed as the settlers, the Vikings, they brought with him here. But this is definitely authentic. And the price is also a little bit higher, but it is definitely worth it. <laughs> wow. Okay. How are you? <laughs> oh, you know, are you upset? Not upset, are you? Can't be upset. Okay, okay. You don't like touching your eyes. Hi. Oh, hi. Yeah, so I want to take a picture. Hi. Is it? Yeah. Oh, hi. Hi. Yes. <laughs> Hello. Go <laughs> away. Horse, horse. I don't see any fish. It might have brain eating amoebas. Good place to get some refreshments and if you have any trash. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like some, yeah, we don't have one. And there's just we some. Don't need one they stay overnight. Exactly. Eating the Icelandic hot dog. Yeah. The hot dog is better than at home. It's not salty. The skin is like super crunchy. Inside is like it's just a nice, um, juicy, bouncy uh, texture. Mm. <laughs> Seems like they're only available at these uh, gas stations. Yeah. And that was Iceland's Golden Circle and concludes the first day of our two-day tour. Stay tuned for part two, where we'll visit some amazing waterfalls and the famous black sand beach of Rinnisfara.
We'd love to read your comments, and if you have any questions, we'd be happy to help out. Thank you very much. Happy traveling, and we'll see you soon in another video.